Well, we're noticing that there's a preponderance of cancer that's taking place right now. Over a two-week period this summer, my wife and I saw four loved ones leave the planet, all the result of cancer. Now, we're not saying this is a bad thing. We're not judging cancer as something that's uh, wrong or people who, who are suffering from cancer is wrong. However, we're noticing that a lot of people are leaving the planet because of cancer. And cancer, if you look at what cancer is, cancer is a conglomeration of rogue cells that are going over and taking over the body. The body exists as a conglomerate of cells that all have their own job, their own function, their own responsibility, but they're all working together for the good of the whole, for the good of the, the entire body. And a cancerous cell has a, has a field around it that uh, disengages us, or that disengages it from receiving the messages from the uh, uh, the central command, so to speak, from the body. And instead of working for the good of the body, it tries to take over. It takes over and infects other cells, destroying the rest of the body. And ultimately the entire body dies as a result of this parasitic activity. Well this is, I'm very clear that the reason that so many people are experiencing cancer on the planet at this time is because what is essentially going on on the planet right now is cancerous activity. Just as we have in our body a tremendous number of cells. We are all, all of the members of creation on this planet at this time, are all like cells in a greater body, this body being the earth. And we can either contribute toward the good of that body, or we can act as rogue cells, trying to take over and infecting other cells and causing harm and damage to other cells. So what we're seeing taking place on the planet, global warming, what we're seeing taking place on the planet in terms of uh, the destruction of the Earth's natural resources, what we're seeing taking place in terms of uh, the uh, depletion of the rainforest, of the rainforest and, and the ozone layer, and what we're seeing in terms of uh, the pollution of the air as well as the water. This is cancerous activity that is created as a result of cancerous cells, if you will. Members of the creation, generally human, who are doing something with a concern for nothing more than what they believe is best for them without concern for the greater good. I believe and I'm convinced that once we start all being more conscious, about how we can best serve the greater good, not being so concerned about me only, but how we can best serve the greater good, then this preponderance of cancer will begin to disappear.